I'm Julie and this is Trisha and we are from the Waterford Public Library. Raise your hand if you have a library card. That's great. But you know what? Even if you don't have a library card, you can join us this summer for our summer reading challenge. This year's theme is tales and tales. One of our favorite fairy tales is Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Raise your hand if you know that story. Wait just one minute. You have never heard the real story. The real deal is Goldilocks is not a cute little blonde girl. Enter me, Goatilocks, and I'm going to tell you what really happened. Once upon a time, there was me, Goatilocks. I lived down the road from a family of bears. The bears went out for a walk one morning, and can you guess what I did? I snuck into their house. Inside the house, I found three bowls of porridge. I tried the biggest bowl, but it was too hot. I tried the medium bowl, but it was too cold. I tried the littlest bowl, and it was just right. So I ate it, the little spoon and all. Mm. Next, I went into the other room and I found three chairs. I tried the biggest chair, but it was too hard. I tried the medium chair, but it was too soft. And then I tried the littlest chair and oh, it was just right. So I ate it, cushions and all. Then I started to get a little sleepy. So I wandered upstairs and I found three beds. I tried the biggest bed, but it was too lumpy. I tried the medium sized bed, but it was too squishy. I tested the little bed and oh, it was just right. So can you guess what I did? Yep, I ate it, including two pillows, a blanket, and a pair of pajamas. Well then I was really full and really sleepy. So I curled up on the floor and I fell asleep. I'm Mama Bear and let me tell you what I remember from that day. So I decided to make porridge for breakfast, but it was too hot. So Papa Bear, myself, and Baby Bear, we all took a walk. But when we got home, guess what happened? It all started when Papa Bear yelled, someone's been eating my porridge. And I looked, someone was eating my porridge too. And Baby Bear cried, hey, where's my porridge? Well, then from the other room, Papa Bear yelled, get a load of this. Someone was sitting in my chair. I peeked over and, oh, gracious, someone was sitting in my chair too. And then poor Baby Bear said, hey, where is my chair? Well, we decided to creep up the stairs and you would never guess what we found on the floor, the culprit. Poor Baby cried, hey, where's my bed? It's gone. And Cody Locks woke up and she saw us staring at her. So quickly, she jumped up and hoofed it home. But that's not where the story ends. The next day I woke up and well, I was feeling a little sheepish. I wanted to do something to make it up to my neighbors, the bears, but I couldn't think of what to do. And then I looked out my window and I had an idea. Who would turn down an apology if it came with flowers? I'm sorry, Mama Bear. Well, her apology was pretty beautiful. In fact, it was so perfect that we ate it. And that is the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears. We there are lots of different versions of fairy tales you can check out at the Waterford Library. And we have lots of programs you can join us at this summer. We have June Dairy Days, where the 4-H kids from Can Do 4-H are gonna bring their animals and we're gonna have a petting zoo and games and dairy treats like ice cream. You can adopt a new stuffed animal at our Adopt a Plush Pet Party on June 24th. You can sign up to read to Mushu, the library's bearded dragon. You can come meet a pig and a two-toed sloth and a hawk and an owl at our World of Animals program on July 7th. 
And we're gonna have two family concerts in the park, one on July 21st and on one on August 11th. And that's not all. You can also win great prizes just for reading or coming to check things out at the library. You could win this giant stuffed pig. You can adopt an animal from the Milwaukee Zoo and go visit that animal. You could win a kite tails package where you'll get two giant kites to fly with your family and a gift card for some ice cream. You could also win a family game night package where you'll get lots of board games and card games to play with your family. And if you come check out materials, you could stop in on one of our checkout party days where you could get things like a ring pop or ice cream and you can earn one of our new things, which is summer book bucks. You earn book bucks each time you check something out at the library. Collect them and you can spend them at the Summer Reading Prize Store in July. We'll have candy and stuffed animals and other fun prizes for you to purchase with your book bucks. So as soon as school is over, starting June 11th, come on down to the Waterford Library and join us for summer reading. There'll be a little bit of fairy tales, a little bit of animal tales, and lots of prizes and fun.